Well, hello everybody. It's December 2nd. I'm venturing out on some of the back property with the truck. Can't really see where we're at, but behind those trees is where the shop is. And we're heading down a trail that I usually only take the quad on because the trails are narrow and rocky. But I'm feeling adventurous today. Brought the truck down. Let's go have some coffee. If you look across the valley there, we're looking towards Sholo on the horizon. And again, the White Mountains over there. Some days much more clear. I'm on the uh, western, northwestern edge of the property, which is quite a rough walk. It's bad enough on the quad having to cut in between these junipers and things because uh, it's not really wide enough for the vehicle. Although, today I don't care. Take the truck down here. I'm going to relax a little bit. Made a couple of campsites down on here. They could stay at at some point in time. This is one of the only accesses for a regular vehicle to come down and then you have to negotiate this huge bed. I already bottomed out on some of these rocks. They're sticking up a little higher than I thought. Uh, there's no way to dig them out. I don't think. It could probably be in the backhoe down here, but some of these are actually just part of the mountain. They're not actually rocks. They're part of the mountain. So down here, looking across the valley, is the direction I can see all the storms that come this way. And I live on this point of the mountain where the storms come to me like the bow of a ship and then they split off and go one way or the other and with our elevation at 6600 feet when the clouds come over they're almost low enough to touch and I do mean that it's like the it's very odd because you could probably hit them with an arrow and when I look at some of them I can see over the edge towards the top of the clouds when we have our thunderstorms, they go all around this area of the rim. So this valley here is sort of like a bowl. And then goes all the way over to the, the hills that you can't see right now where the lights are for the city of Sholo and Lakeside. And possibly even over to... Um, I forget what the name of the place is. It's the altitude, man. You lose your memory up here. And once again, it looks like you could fall down safely here on this nice soft grass. But you will die. You will die from rock damage. I can't tell you how many unlived folks I've found down here that have fallen down and have never left. I had to make it put up the no trespassing signs to keep people out of here. And so this is a little spot that I found, kind of cleared it out a little bit. You could pitch a tent down here, get out of the wind from this old tree. Anyway, just wanted to say, hi, how are ya? Don't worry about me, I'm fine. I'm gonna have some coffee and enjoy the weather here. And uh, you do the same.